Welcome to Data Doctor's video, Suggestion 863, Missing References Tag. Reference tags come in two parts. The first, the inline citation, which goes in the biography section, is a pair of multiple open and closed ref tags. The second part, which goes in the sources section, is the references tag. Note that there should be a space between references and the forward slash. Suggestion 863 is reporting that this tag is missing. That could be because it isn't there, or because it has been mistyped by being misspelled, or having the angled brackets or forward slash wrong. Here is a profile in its public view. The biography section shows a numbered reference used twice, which indicates a named reference, and yet it is not listed in the sources section. That is because there is no references tag. Before proceeding, check if there are more suggestions. On the top right, click on the person's Wikitree ID. From the drop-down menu, scroll to the end and click on Suggestions. The next screen shows how many suggestions are for this profile. There is only one. Return to the profile and click Edit. See the named reference in the biography? and its second use. Note that below the sources heading, the references tag is missing. Add the tag just beneath the sources heading, where it should always be. Remember to add a space between the word references and the forward slash. Now, click on the preview button to check your work. The numbered reference in the biography is now properly showing in the sources section. Go to the middle of the screen and explain your changes. This is required for all data doctors. I identify myself as a data doctor, copy the suggestion number and name, then explain what I did. In this case, I added the references tag. Save your changes. Return to the suggestion status page. From here, choose a status, in this case, corrected. Then leave a comment. You can pick one from the comment hints or make one of your own. The last step is to click the Update Status button. The next screen will show the update in the status history. And you're done.